And the Humanitarian Legal Assistance NGO of El Salvador launched a campaign to demand the government proof of life of thousands of people detained by the emergency regime pursued by President Nayib Bukele. As part of the assistance provided to the families of isolated detainees, the NGO requested judges to order a medical examination in prisons. So far, the police have incarcerated over 81,900 people. Therefore, humanitarian entities described many of the arrests as arbitrary and illegal. In addition, they denounced death and serious injuries, assuring that Bukele is selling a fake security model. The unconstitutional president Nayib Bukele, let's say something important about him. He went there to the United Nations to lie. That is the truth. The unconstitutional president Nayib Bukele went to the United Nations to lie. Why do I say he was lying? Because he dared to say that human rights are respected here in El Salvador, which, first of all, is not true. Here, there are thousands of innocent people who are being processed unfairly for 30 months already in five prisons. And the majority isn't in top security Sekot prison of which he makes so much propaganda in favor of what we now know as the regime of exception. <laughs>